Hi, I'm Julian. My family and I run Barossa Farm and we make Christmas puddings. Well, we start the process of speaking to our suppliers early in the year to ensure that we have the products that we need at the time that we need them. Sometimes that one phone call can save you 20 phone calls later in the year. A corporate might come along and one year ask for 101 kilo puddings, but then the following year they might want to change it and they might want 100 half kilo puddings. So you do need to add a little bit of flexibility to your production system. Margin in our minds is the critical component because at the end of the day, you need to have sufficient margin, not just to pay yourself today, but also fund your forward activity. And that's often lost in a seasonal business because there could be a period where you're not actually in business. I know it might sound simple, but it's important that you understand how it is that you make, what it is that you make. Well, we sat down and worked out what all the limiting factors were on the process of producing puddings. And then we matched the technology around that. For example, we boil our puddings for six hours. So really it doesn't matter whether or not we've got one pot burning or we've got 10 pots burning. At the end of the day, time is what's limiting us there. And that way we're able to identify how many puddings or pots we need to be boiling during that period to make maximum use of that time. Our business is constant, but at the same time it's constantly growing. We've never gone about trying to chase large volumes, large quantities, because otherwise you may find yourself in a situation where you've worked twice as hard for half as much. After all, there's not much demand for Christmas puddings on the 1st of January.